Chapter 6, Question 7 from the Gravitor and Walno textbook, Statistics for the Behavioral Sciences, 10th edition. The question asks, or states, find each of the following probabilities for a normal distribution. A, Z, the probability that Z is greater than 1.25. So let's draw it out. Here's a z-square of 0. Probability of 1.25 is over here. And the question asks, it, it's greater than, so we want this part. We want going this way. We want this piece. So that's the tail. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the unit normal table. We're going to look up 1.25 in column A. And we're going to go across to the tail, which is in column C. And we are going to see that that probability is 0 0.1056. B, the probability of Z greater than negative 0 0.60. So again, let's draw it out. Now it's a negative, so it's over here, 0 0.60, and we want, again, greater. So we want the body in this case. So we're going to go to that unit normal table. We're going to find 0 0.60. Now remember that the normal curve is symmetrical. So even though the table only has positive z scores because the distribution is symmetrical it also has all of the negative values so we want to go to the b the column b the proportion in the body and so this probability this probability is equal to 0 0.7 Question C asks the probability that a z-score is less than 0 0.70. So if we draw this out, this z-score is over here. But now we're asking for less than, so we're asking for this part, and that is the body. So this is up here, this is tail, body, here again, we're looking for the body. The body, the probability here, column B, is 0 0.7580. Question D, the probability that the z-score is less than negative 1.30. So negative is over here, and we want less than, so we want this part, so we want tail in this case. One point three zero over to proportion in the tail, that probability P is equal to 0 0.0968.